A college student and the son of an L.A. County fire captain, now the prime suspect in the attack, kidnapping, and brutal murder of a Whittier woman. Good evening, everyone, and thank you for joining us on KCAL News at 5 on CBS Los Angeles. I'm Pat Harvey. And I'm Jeff Vaughn. We're also streaming live on CBS News Los Angeles. Our top story tonight at 5 o'clock, 20-year-old Gabriel Esparza charged with murder, kidnapping, and attempted rape. He's accused of abducting a 19-year-old woman from Whittier Park, killing her and then dumping her body in a field. KCAL News reporter Jasmine Veal is in downtown L.A. where Esparza faced a judge for the first time. Jazz. These are shocking charges that rattled the victim's family even more. Inside the courthouse here, the college student from Whittier pleaded not guilty to charges of murder, kidnapping, and attempted rape in the death of the Downey teen as both families sat only a row apart. Yes. Uttering only a single yes to the judge, Gabriel Esparza stood emotionless behind the glass box in court Wednesday with his attorney, Ambrosio Rodriguez, and entered a not guilty plea to seven counts. Those counts include kidnapping, murder, and attempted rape of 19 year old Andrea Vasquez. His demeanor is one of sadness, shock, and uh, he's scared. He doesn't know what's going to happen. It's a I mean, it's extremely, it doesn't get more serious than this. Rodriguez stressed his client is innocent until proven guilty. He says Esparza comes from a good family. He confirmed to us the 20 year old's father is an LA County fire captain. My client has no criminal record, comes from a very good family, was a full time college student, had a full time job. Um, and everyone in this case uh, is in shock. Outside the courthouse, Vasquez's family says they wanted to see the man accused of killing the college student who had dreams of being a designer. Today was horrible and um, we're just here to get justice for my sister and um, to be a voice for her. She just is starting her life. Um, I don't think it's... I don't think it's fair that this happened and I don't want this not happen to other girl. Whittier police detectives say Vasquez was shot at and kidnapped from a Whittier parking lot early Sunday while with her boyfriend. He survived. Esparza is also charged with his attempted murder. He is a true victim. Vasquez's body was found by detectives in a Moreno Valley field late Monday night after detectives tracked her cell phone. Detectives say the couple was randomly targeted. Rodriguez says he can't confirm if Esparza knew Andrea, adding there's a lot to learn about what happened. The victim's family says there is no connection, they believe, between Esparza and Vasquez, only that Esparza lives very close to the crime scene there in Penn Park in Whittier. Esparza has no bail. His next court date is in October. Here in downtown LA, Jasmine Veal, KCAL News.